Hey Pastry Puffs, welcome back to Strudel Reviews, it's your girl Strudel, and today we are going to be reviewing LOL OMG Series 3 Miss Class Prez. But before we start, if I mess anything up, just letting y'all know I'm delirious as all fuck today. <laughs> Cause, uh, I forgot to feed myself as soon as I got up this morning. <laughs> and it was so bad I almost passed out at work. And, don't worry, I kind of fed myself a little more. Although I shouldn't have gone out of the house, but this dang thing I am looking for eludes me. And I want it so bad. <laughs> this is what I get for simping for things that I don't need. <laughs> I'm sorry, excuse me while I uh, try not to cry over it. As we are trying to do a review, and that is not very professional of me. Ahem. To start off, we got the uh, obligatory thin, straight eyebrows. So boring. I am so sick of the thin, straight eyebrows. Please bring back the neonlicious slash cosmic nova wavy brow. That was kind of interesting. And then, like, she's got this, uh, I want to say it's like bubblegum pink eyeshadow and she's got like really gorgeous blue eyes at least I think that no yeah they are blue and then she's got like really pretty pink lips <laughs> which makes me think of like a Believe Beauty lipstick shade called Hope Pink if I said that right <laughs> I promise I know how to read somewhat <laughs> I, I, I know how to read somewhat. I'm <laughs> just an idiot. <laughs> um, and then we kind of... So once the focus. And then we kind of go down to her little um, undershirt. And you see, like, the top... The neck has, like, little hashtags. And then the shirt has, like, the alphabet. And then it says, like, Fierce, JK, LOL, OMG. And, like, right there under the... Uh, under a certain body part, I don't think I can say the name of, it says Queen. Very interesting. And then, like, the rib cage band has a whole bunch of exclamation points. And then the little cropped blazer is this adorable little buffalo plaid. At least I'm certain it is buffalo plaid. Forgive me, I'm delirious as all fuck again. Um, so, yeah. And then, like, it's a quarter sleeve. No, three-fourths. Three-fourths sleeves. I don't, f I don't know. I didn't go to fucking school for maths. Um, so, yeah. And then, like, there are no buttons, but, like, there's a little bit of frying on the jacket, but I've had this for, like, almost a year now, so, eh. She kind of lives in a closet. And then, like, you can see, like, the waistband of her skirt. It's a little high-waisted, and it's black. And it's got, like, white, what I would say is, like, gym short material, like, as the stripe. And then the skirt is a mini skirt with the same buffalo plaid that the cropped blazer is. And then we go down to the knee-high socks, which are a really soft satiny material, which, mmm, me likes. And it's got, like, two little white stripes. Kind of looks like gym socks, but... Eh, don't mind. And then we go down to the shoe. And they are supposed to be Oxford-type shoes. You know, like, I'm richer than you, and I have more money than you. You must deal with it. Type, um... Type shoes. And, like, you can see they got, like, little suede fringe, because I think Oxfords have suede. But then I, I'm an idiot, so don't take my wording for it. And you can see, like, there's a super chunky heel. Because I think Oxfords are supposed to be flats. So they gave them, like, these really super chunky heels, and it's a solid black with, like, the little, um gold printing and it says BB 
Because uh, I assume they're trying to copy Chanel somewhat. And then the bottom of the shoe is just smooth and black. Which, again, is no fun. And then we go up to the earrings. You can see they're just a typical gold hoop with a gold post. Which, eh. I've seen where in her earring fell out. <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. I am not a professional and I should probably not be trying to put this earring back in when I can't see clearly. I promise I'm wearing my glasses. It's just my vision has been a little blurred all day. Eh. Get back in the ear. Okay, good. I didn't ruin any of the hair. Ahem. So, um, now we go to like this adorable little detail on her face that I forgot to mention, but she has little freckles. How cute. And then like you look at her hair, it's this really pretty, I want to say pinkish red. Because it's like a, I'm not really sure what the color, it's not fuchsia because I'm trying to look at my Stella Monroe and check her review out. And her hair is a lot brighter than this. So I would say this is like a pinky red and you can see like there's these gorgeous, gorgeous baloney curls. And you can tell I do not like to mess with my doll's hair because I don't know how to fix this. I am not a hairstylist. Although, I do my own hair. <laughs> I color my own hair. I don't style it very well because I have no dexterity to sit there for hours to do my hair like that. And then, like, she's got the typical, like pivot in the neck. She's got shoulder, elbow, wrist. I almost called this an elbow. Uh, hip and then knee articulation. As you know, OMG dolls have the old style Barbie bend and snap knee, which uh, the satisfying click. And then she's got like this really interesting darkish blue colored stand that I don't think any other character has used. So that's good. And then she's got like bubblegum pink nails, which, eh, I guess is cute. And I forgot to say like she's got little braid on the top of her head, which is super, super cute. And she does have, um, as most, as a lot of people who, I'm sure some people here who watch this have collected OMG dolls themselves. Or if you have class prez yourself, good luck trying to find her for a decent price on the secondhand market because I got her on clearance around Christmas last year for 17 and I do not regret that. But like, she's beautiful. And, like, I highly recommend her for people who are interested in buying her. And I do want to say, like, um, for, uh, not a related reason, I was looking at, uh, OMG Dolls, like, listings to see if any, anything that I was interested in has, interested in buying has come to my area yet. And... Uh, certain websites have Black Friday prices already, and I've just been watching them like a hawk, so if they're still going on tomorrow, <laughs> oh, dude, y'all are gonna be in for a surprise. <laughs> but, um, also, the, um, OMG line has recent, OMG has recently come out with their first budget line, the swim line. The only one I was really originally interested in, I do have in my closet, and then I saw the one with the pink wetsuit in person, and I was, I fell in love, and I kind of left it behind, because I was like, I don't know, I'll come back, because I didn't really want to pay $15 for it, and then I had to go back to the same store to go get stuff for my mini strudel, because, yes, mini strudel is a person, 
And no, I'm not going further into for privacy reasons. Um, <clears throat> so I decided to like, hey, let me go see if they still have like such and such. I go back and they only have the one and I'm trying to track down the other and it's been driving me insane because I like the pink wetsuit doll and I regret not buying her. I really hope I can find her soon. <laughs> <clears throat> but, like, yeah, no. And, it, by the way, I'm talking about this doll. If anybody is asking if I'm interested in men or women, the answer is yes. Take that information what you will. <clears throat> so, anyway. Like, uh... She's gorgeous. Very clueless vibes. Oh, I forgot to mention she has like a pair of shades that are like half glasses and they are everything. If this outfit was in black, I would buy it. Because I very love, I very much love a all black moment because I feel like I not only stole all my non-existent dead husband's money. Because I don't want a husband in real life. I don't need a husband. If I can just come across the money that will set me up for life, I'll be okay. <clears throat> but, uh, but I also like to have the mantra of I am like a powerful businesswoman and I'm not afraid to push you down and step on you to take all your money. Oh, and I'm not going to actually take all your money. I'm just going to push you down and step on you so I can reach towards my own money. <laughs> I can't. I need to go to bed. I am too delirious <laughs> today. <laughs> I feel like I sound like I am high off a of Vicodin or something. <laughs> Again, this is not a kid's channel, so if you're a gremlin, do not watch this. <laughs> With that, uh, I'll see you guys in the next <laughs> Bye.